Hello there, everybody. Welcome to a brand new Alexa look. Today we're taking a look at Pity Pit, which is a retro style uh, roguelite that kind of has a similar vibe to Downwell, in my opinion. It's kind of Downwell uh, meets Dig Dug. Um, you're constantly going down throughout the uh, world, and you're you're digging, finding treasure. Uh, and in general, you're just, you know, seeing where life goes. So you can see uh, in our inventory, we have a couple of different things we can pick up. There's different power-ups, but then there's also coal and a bunch of iron bars and gold bars and copper bars and diamonds. Um, it's pretty straightforward. So we're this little guy uh, who looks like the shopkeeper from Spelunky. Uh, we have a jump that we can do uh, in any direction, and we have a pickaxe that we can use to uh, smack rocks. So we can do a little down attack here to do a little little bouncy boy uh this is this is literally the main menu so you can actually come here and turn off the sounds if you want um but the the music is is great i love the style of the game uh big thank you to the devs for reaching out and uh supplying me a key panda indie studio um it looked interesting it looked interesting uh i one of my favorite retro games of all time so here we started the the run now so we got some coal we got some gold we got some rock I can't, I can't go through this, apparently. Okay, fair enough, I'll go this way. That's fine. And there's enemies and all kinds of stuff. But, uh, one of my favorite games as, uh, a kid was, uh, oh, now, now the freaking, the top is coming down, dude. I'm very scared. You also, you cannot fire the pickaxe up, um, which I, I've had issues with, and now I'm dead because I'm, I'm bad at the game. Um. It's going to take a little bit for me to get used to it, for sure. Uh, it's got an interesting vibe, but uh, growing up, I, you know, when I was learning what a video game even was, the the old, you know, Namco, was that, that the name of the, the company? The old, old Namco games, Pac-Man and, and Dig Dug and all that. Dig Dug was always one of my favorites. Um, I don't know why, even, um, but it just... Little, little Tyler really liked Dig Dug, so, um, can we get into this? It appears you, you can, it just takes a lot to, to mine through this. So now we have a, a diamond bomb, okay. I don't know what the diamond bomb does. I suppose we'll figure it out. But we're, we're moving. I don't know what anything does in the game. Um, like, I, I, we're, we're getting a ton of coal, we've got copper, we've got... There's, there's rock up here that we can snag. I don't know what any of it does. So we're going to learn. I'm sure there's going to be eventually uh, a, a shop or something. We're dead again, dude. Two hearts is not a lot. I mean, there's a lot of enemies, man. I look like an absolute idiot right now because I, I look like I'm very bad at the game. And to be fair, I am, but that that is neither here nor there. That shouldn't, shouldn't be a problem for me to be horrendous at video games. We're all used to this at this point. Okay, I've got a ton of coal now. And then I proceeded to... This guy's got shields around, dude. I'm dead. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of strategy. You gotta think on your feet uh, pretty fast. Because the, the top is coming down on top of you as you go as well. So you have to pay attention to that. Uh, and you gotta pay attention to, you know, collecting all the resources, which are, I, I believe they're really just points, right? Um, so you're, you're, you're battling to get a high score, um, copper shovel. I'd imagine that the copper shovel is just an upgrade, right? Like that, that's what we got going on here. It's just an upgrade to our, our previous shovel. I am getting, so the coins appear to be different. Okay, that's, that's... TNT, okay. Okay, interesting. For sure, interesting. There's more TNT here, but I can't really do much of that. I, I got no bombs, now I got a bomb. I don't really know how to use the bomb, so I'll probably end up nuking myself the first time. Ah, I used the bomb, dude. Ah, I got scared, I'm sorry. Okay, it's fine. We're, we're good. So this guy eats blocks. He ate the TNT, dude. He's a psycho. He's an absolute psycho. My heart's friggin' racing. <laughs> this game is stressful. Okay, you're dead. Thank you. Sheesh. I've reached digger level one. 
I think that's something to be proud of. I, I, I am, I am very bad, dude. I'm very, this is ridiculously hard. This is ridiculously hard. Uh, this game is available for $5 on Steam. So if you are uh, interested in a, in a fun retro style game, maybe let Pity Pit be your next uh, game to take in. These guys appear to die in one hit, which is is useful. What We get rocks from those. Okay. I, I haven't been paying attention to what gives me the most points. Um, so let, let's pay attention here. So we're at 1135. Copper gives you 35. Coal gives you 10. So coal is pretty bad, to be honest. What is this? Jump up. Oh, jeez. I got, like, a super jump now. I don't know why, but I that that alarms me a little bit. We can also do, like, there's, there's like, a pickaxe jump, too. I'm sorry. I don't know all of the intense mechanics of Pity Pit yet. Okay. Shield Boy is a pain in the rear. Do not let that man get near you. Because otherwise, I mean, he he is just impossible to kill. Like, I'm not even sure there is a way to kill him. You might have to, like, do a, a pickaxe on his head. Okay, so if we spend the bomb here, we can get the bombs. Is that how that works? Oh, we're, we're just dead because those guys, those guys are so strong, dude. They're so strong. I don't, I don't know how to combat them. I really don't. Okay. Get ready, brother. Get ready. We're, we're making it work. We're making it work. Okay, we did not make it work. I really wanted that bomb. There is no way in hell I'm getting in there. Okay. At least try to snag some of this. Hi, friend. Get out of my face. I will say the screen shake gets a little annoying uh, while playing. But, I mean, it's, it's brutally difficult. I will give them that. If they're going for a difficult one, they they have succeeded. I also want to be able to go down through these platforms, uh, a la like a, like a Terraria, you know. And they will not let me through them. So you always have to break your way down from wherever you are. You're dead. You're dead. Okay, now we're getting in a groove, dude. Now we're getting in a groove. These guys are still. They're, they're, they're a little dicey. They're a little dicey. My jump is not high enough to snag those. Gosh darn it. And then I... I knew it as soon as I did it, dude. I knew it as soon as I did it. Darn it. We're, we're gonna, we're gonna advance. We're, I got, I got faith in myself, dude. I got faith in myself. We'll make our way there. So you want me to spend the bomb here. So yeah, I can't do that, and I can't do that. So how the hell else, there's no way that I can get that bomb, right? At least I, I sure as hell don't think there is. I don't know, I don't know if like I can, I can, this is gonna sound really dumb when I say it, but I don't know if I can like craft anything with the, the coal or something. Just trying to comprehend how I could uh, get some benefit here. Do I have bombs? It says I don't, but I, I definitely feel like I just picked up a bomb. What, what's going on? I got no power-ups, no no nothing. Okay. I might have accidentally placed a bomb. Maybe. Okay. Honestly, that worked. Okay, I have a bomb. Let, let's use the bomb very cautiously. Look at this, dude. I mean, the interior of this is good, but I'm going to let those guys do them. Oh, baby. Now we're starting to get the hang of it. It only took a little bit. Except. Now, now this guy's coming. He goes through walls, man. I can't stop him. He's too strong. <laughs> He's actually the strongest boy. Uh, I don't know what money does. I feel like I might after, you know, we're on level one right now. I feel like there might be like an in-between level that maybe um, has a shop or something. That's the only explanation that I, I can possibly have. And then that shop maybe provides us with the ability. I, I, that's, that, I mean, that's the worst we've done yet to be blunt. Um, but I, 
I hope there's a shop at least, and then maybe you can buy back some HP or something. Because I am... I am big time struggling with this one right now. Okay, these guys, though! I'm... Dude, I'm so bad. I'm so bad. It's harder than it looks, I will say. The, the jumping is a little... I, I don't know if I want to call it sticky. Because the controls aren't really sticky, but the guy is very... He's slidey. He's very, very slidey. Um, he just kind of skates around the screen. So it's difficult to control him. Um, but, I mean, it, it plays like an old retro game. So I, I get the vibe that they're going for here. Well, I guess I'll die. I don't know how to beat him. Maybe, maybe you gotta do... Yeah, I guess that's the move, is you gotta do the, the down attack on him when he's coming. Yeah, okay. Oh, now I have the keys to the kingdom. Now you're toast. Now you're toast. I've, I I won't die to other enemies. Okay, except for literally the enemy that I keep on saying I don't want to die to. Alright, respect. Respect. We, we try again. We try again. When in doubt, you know, just keep on trying. Uh, so a lot of money if I can set off this TNT, which I absolutely was able to do. Look at that. There's a free bomb in here as well. Baby, we're, we're chilling now. So what do you do with bombs, huh? Like, what what is the ideal strategy with bombs? I'm still trying to figure that out, to be perfectly blunt. Um, I don't know if they're, uh, they're a combat driven thing. Oh, baby, he's so good. He figured out how to kill that guy. I figured that was how you did it. I don't know if it's a combat driven thing. Um, you just use the bombs to blow up enemies. Or if it's a, uh, you save them for the certain areas that are like, hey, in order to get in here, you need a bomb. You do something like that. Beautiful. He's so good. Snag everything of value. Bad plays as a whole. Bad plays. We, we, we got bested by... Uh, oh, that was a far drop. Okay. Thank God there's no fall damage. There's a shop, dude. Pause to use it. Oh my God. Okay, a life potion. Is It's, it's just a heart. That's great. Um, oh, you can spend coal and rock to get things, dude. Okay. That's cool. Well, let's do that. I will say the bright flash is is actually just the most horrendous thing uh, I've ever experienced in a video game. I would highly recommend not doing that. Um, and if you are light sensitive in any way, shape, or form, uh, I would look away from the screen. There is a bomb. I tried very hard to get in there. Oh, dude. Oh, this is a forge. I thought this was an end of a level, maybe. Uh, so I can make steel. I can make an iron pick. Or pick iron. I have, I have no idea what the hell this means. Um, okay, do this. Oh, dude, the, the flashing light. I'm I'm actually really sorry. That that is horrible. Oh god, we can make everything. I did not realize this. And now I'm out of coal cuz I'm dumb. Okay. Oh, we made a mistake there. That's okay. And that dude level 2. Oh baby. Okay. Now we're in. What what have we accomplished? Are our shovels better? Um we're able to mine two blocks in every direction now. That's really neat. I'm also getting, I'm getting steam, steam achievements out the ass, dude. Which is great if you're a uh, achievement hunter. Oh, these take a little bit to knock out. Hello, friend. Wow, why in the world he's like way stronger than he was before? Okay. I mean, respect, but I'm a little annoyed. Are you stronger too? He didn't seem that much stronger. It's going fine, though. Dude, we made it way farther this time around. Okay. That That is C minus TNT. I don't, I, I don't know how the hell to get out of that. I don't know how to get out of that, to be, to be perfectly honest with you. I got nothing. 
Okay, uh, let's give it like one more try, uh, and then and then we'll call it one more good try here. We'll call it a day. It's a unique game, dude. Uh, I don't see this being one that you know you're gonna play for the rest of your life. You know, it ain't no revolutionary uh, roguelite. And hey, thanks for the follow on Twitch, somebody. Uh, it ain't no revolutionary roguelite, but uh, there, it's got some interesting ideas here, and I, I think that a a dig dug style roguelite is something that I would really love to see uh, sometime. It's a unique idea, for sure. But we have a new bomb that sucked. Okay, you are just bad, Tyler, is what that boils down to. Give me all this. So I'm assuming if I spend it... Okay, that did not go according to plan. I'm gonna get killed by the friggin' rock above, dude. Okay. This guy's multiple hits. Beautiful. Little bit dicey through here, but we, we're bringing it back around. Okay, that went fine. Spend the TNT. Beautiful. TNT takes a little bit to explode. That's something that we, we need to remember as we play. There's a lot of... I, I don't know if it's just the, the theme of the game, but there's some Spelunky vibes that I get too. Um, where it's kind of like you make one mistake, you're friggin' dead, dude. Um, so I like that. I think that's also an interesting, uh, component of this one. We got a shop. Beautiful. This just proves that I'm getting better at the game. I can regularly get here. Give me the life potion. Please stop flashing my screen. Oh, we can just get all kinds of stuff here. I don't know what the difference in the bombs are. Um, that's one that I'm still... Might need to figure out a little bit more in the future. But, um, okay. Let's make... I, I, I just don't know what any of this means. Um, so I think, like, getting a... Getting a steel shovel would be great. So let's... Well, I mean, look, we, we need to get a copper one, right? So we can just do, we can just, I don't know why it won't let me do this. There we go. So now I have a, a copper shovel. And then let's, can't do that. That makes steel. Flash my face real quick. Okay. I don't know, dude. I'm, I'm a little confused as a whole, um, but it's, it's working, right? It's working. We're having an interesting enough time with it. Let's take all these. Thanks for the money. See, anywhere where there's copper, I'm immediately like, now I, I kind of want it. Because the, the copper shovel is a hell of an upgrade. These guys hit for way more now. And by hit for way more, I mean I need to hit them for way more. Okay, shield boys. We can avoid them, actually. Just, just pretend they don't exist. Significantly easier. Coal is also, like, one of the most important upgrades, it seems. More shield boys. Just ignore them, dude. You don't need shield boys. They're fine. Money also obviously important. What is this here? That's iron. Okay. So iron is the purpley one. Uh, let's get another life potion. I still think that as a whole, just getting coal is pretty important. Hi, flashing lights. I'm very sorry. I, I actually have to put a, a, a light sensitivity warning on this video. Um, cause that is, it is some very, very flashy lights. Um, I really, really don't like that, like, a lot. Dev, if you're listening, please, please consider changing that, or else you're gonna kill somebody. <laughs> and I don't think you want to do that, to be perfectly honest. Okay, steel? No. Iron, there we go. No, steel. Oh, I have an iron pick now. What the hell's the difference? So now, now we have, so the, the pickaxe, I think the pickaxe only does one block, whereas the shovel does two. Why would you not always go shovel? Oh, this is trippy. Why would you not always go shovel? Does the pick, oh, the, you, you fire little things. Okay, fair enough. I got you. Now we got freaking... A spider or something. Oh, uh, dude. It's hard. It's a hard game. Uh, it's interesting, though. That's going to do it for this uh, little Alexa look. Thank you guys so much for watching.
as always, a like on the video is much appreciated. You can check out Pity Pit in the link in the description. I think it's a, a unique retro roguelite, something that we don't see uh, a whole hell of a lot anymore. So uh, check it out. See how far you can get. And uh, please do not ever play this if you have light sensitivity, because now my eyes are kind of flashing and I have a little bit of a headache, which is why I'm ending the video 20 minutes in. But that's okay. That's not a problem. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the future. You have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.